Brady kept their first under brand new head coach Rex Ryan and fans pretty excited to see the Bills all in action. Matt Bovee has been at training camp all month long and he's there live tonight. Matt. Fans, a lot of times here at training camp, we're filling into the hospitality tent behind me. You can see it's coming down now. Yeah, it's the same hospitality tent that EJ Manuel hit with that pass that everyone was talking about on Twitter. But the fans coming out in full force this training camp, not necessarily a surprise when you consider the more than 60,000 fans who already, made, or already purchased their season tickets. Now, the fans we talked to today said they really are optimistic about the season upcoming. The Bills did confirm with 7 Eyewitness News today that more fans coming to this year's training camp than any that they can remember in the last decade. Of course, the Rex effect. But one of those things that all of the fans have been looking out for on the field was who's going to finally take the lead in that quarterback competition. Well, out of all the fans we talked to today, every single fan had one person they thought was going to win this job. I think the team's come along real nicely. You know, I think that quarterback play has been better than expected. Uh, I personally am a Tyrod Taylor guy. I think he's kind of stood out so far in the preseason games and camp, but I think the team overall, as long as they stay healthy, will be fine. Who do you think's going to be handing the ball and throwing to Sammy Watkins and handing um, it to Sean McCoy? Well, Tyrod Taylor's been looking good, so he has a chance. I think if you look at Greg Roman's offensive scheme in San Francisco and the mobile quarterback, um, I think it, it'll probably be Tyrod Taylor because he fits uh, Greg Roman's offensive scheme better. Now, we also asked those three fans and several other fans, would this be the year? Would this finally be the year that the Bills ended their 15-year playoff drought? Another unanimous answer. Yes, so the Bills could have a little more time in between when their season ends this year and when they're back right on this field at Grownie Stadium for the start of 2016 training camp. For now, we're live in Pittsburgh, Mapovey 7 Eyewitness News.